Got you, little one. Be brave. He has to go through me first. It's okay, little one. Another one wander away from you, David? Eliab! You should have seen! This lion came out of nowhere, but I beat him! I have no time for your stories. Father wants you. Standing here, I know I'm not alone. A shining light that brings life to me. We look with wonder, what mystery is this? What adventure can this be? A flash of light and the journey begins. And then we'll travel through the ages. The veil is pulled away, the mysteries revealed. The spirit lives within the pages Here we go This is the story This is how we see the light Here we go Come turn the pages Now a super bowl takes flight Here we go These are the stories And the truth that we will find Come travel back with us To extraordinary times Here we go I told you he couldn't be the one you sought. He's a child. Oh, look again at my eldest, Eliab. No. The Lord has chosen this one. David, you have been chosen to one day be king of Israel. for our school band, Quantum. Why are you even bothering to audition? <laughs> hey! <laughs> you sound okay out here, Quantum, but that's different than playing in front of a crowd! Um, Mr. Johnson? The first auditioner for school band guitarist is Chris Quanta. Go ahead, Chris. Show him what you can do. Come on, Chris. What are you doing? You play all the time. Yeah, but not in front of, you know, people.
I don't ever want to see this guitar again. Chris! It is so good to have you home! Chris walked out on his audition. Oh, you said you wouldn't tell anyone. What? I only told Gizmo. He's a robot. He doesn't count. I have what you need right here. Come on, Chris. Once Gizmo fixes your string, there's still time to go back and finish the audition. Uh-uh. Forget it. It was your idea for me to audition in the first place. And it was a bad idea. I'm through playing forever. You know you don't mean that. You, you just had a little stage fright, that's all. No. Todd was right. I can play by myself, but... I haven't got what it takes to make the band and play for crowds of people. Superbook! Oh no! Do not take that thing out! I feel motion sick already! Does anything look familiar? Hmm. I know I have seen you before. Ah! I am registering a strange creature! Warning! Warning! <laughs> Can it, Gizmo? Just do an info scan and tell us where and... and when we are. My geosensors indicate we are outside Bethlehem. I detect two armies about eight miles south-southwest. We are approximately 3,000 years ago. Armies, huh? Uh, that could be cool. Armies aren't cool. Would an attacking bear be cool? Why would a bear attack us? Don't ask me! Ask the bear! Bear! Gizmo, assume defensive posture! I want my mommy! He meant defensive posture! the bear with that? I gotta get me one of those. Nice to see that my defensive posture still works. Yeah, Giz, you were a big help. Who are you? I'm David. I'm Joy. Hey, I'm Chris. I'm hungry. What? I haven't eaten today. Uh, hey, thanks for the save. You might want to stay away from bears in the future. Uh, where are you headed? I'm on my way to bring food to my brothers who are fighting against the Philistines. Excellent! Hey guys, let's check it out! He won't play his guitar in front of a few kids, but he'll walk right into a war zone. Sure, why not? So, have you ever been in a battle like your brothers? My family thinks I'm too small to fight. They think I'm only good enough for tending sheep. Hey Gizmo, listen up. You gotta figure out a way to get us home. Chris has to get back to school before the band audition is over. Joy, you know we cannot go home until Superbook takes us. Oh, but there must be some way we've never tried. Giz, it's important. Well, we could experiment with Einstein's theory of relativity. Really? If I travel faster than the speed of light, I should move forward in time. <laughs> Your friend is a strange one. Oh, you don't know the half of it. The Israelite camp is just below us. Can he disguise himself? I do not need a disguise. I am proud of 
love what I am. If you go down there in your armor, they will force you to fight. Fight? Why, I'm just a poor shepherd boy. Cute. Chicken. What was that? Hear me, hear me, Israelites! Send your best hero. If you win in one on one combat, we and our gods will surrender to you and your god. You don't look so tough. I'll take you on with one hand. Did you think I meant fight me? <laughs> I meant fight Goliath, the giant of Gath! Bow down at my feet, O Israel! Nothing can save you now! Your god can do nothing for you! What are you doing here, baby brother? <sighs> Eliab! We have no use for you. Go tend your flock. Wh what did I do? I was only asking. Leave! This is no place for a child! Doesn't the army know why they're here? Is there not a cause? If none of them will fight this giant, then I will. What? David, you don't have to do this. I've been chosen by the Lord, and my time has come. Our armies are paralyzed. They send out their strongest, and we send out ours. He who wins the battle wins the war. Do we not have anyone willing to fight this warrior? My lord, someone is here to challenge the Philistine giant. Uh, he himself is a giant. Among sheep, David, the shepherd boy. <laughs> this is no time for jesting. Take the boy away. My lord? I am not afraid of any Philistine. What can one child do? What can one child not do when that child goes with God? My lord, God has already delivered me from bears and from lions. He gave me the strength to overcome them. He too will give me strength over this Philistine. stand alone no God will be with me as you wish no, never... <laughs> oh, this is madness enough it is as I say tomorrow you will meet Goliath on the battlefield David May God go with you. Oh, that's pretty cool. Do you play? Eh, nah, used to. Why did you stop? Uh, people might not like the way I play. Well, who do you play for? Other people? Me, I play for the one that gave me the skill. I play for God. I kind of wish I had my guitar now. Thanks, Giz.
play as if touched by the creator himself. Thanks. So do you. And if he gave you those gifts, Chris, should you not use them to his glory? I suppose. David, if everyone else doesn't think you can win against Goliath, what makes you so sure you can? I know in my heart God is with me. He'll give me strength when I need it most. It is just like music. If you use the gifts he's given you, you never need to be afraid to play. So, if God gives you the ability, then the size of the giant, or the size of the audience, doesn't matter? I think you're getting it. This is not going to work. I can't wear the armor. All right. Then at least take my shield. The Lord will be my shield. He's not alone. So, do we have anyone to battle Goliath today? I'm taking numbers. I will fight him. I'm sorry. You're so... small. Come on, people! I asked for a warrior and you send me this? Do you fear the least of Israel? All right then. Goliath! Breakfast is served! My brother is going to get himself killed. Maybe I should... Did you see him? That was my brother David who 
Are we where I think we are? Oh, the auditions are over. Well, who do you play for? I play for God. So, if God gives you the ability, then the size of the giant, or the size of the audience, doesn't matter? Gizmo, my guitar. Go get him, Chris. What do you want? Uh, everyone? Uh, my string broke earlier, and, uh, actually, I was really nervous. And, well, what I'm saying is, I'd like another shot at the audition. No way! Welcome to the band, son. 